Welcome back, Kunarasa fam. We missed you. It's been a week. All right, you're coming with us on our day. First things first, we just got something new. A new addition. Actually, no, we have another addition we have to show you before we show that one. Look at our coffee corner. It's literally perfect. The date is wrong, we gotta change that. This is like the most beautiful coffee corner you'll ever see in your whole life. And we just got a new addition to our kitchen. It's this thingy, my bobber. So we're gonna put it together and figure out what the heck we can do with it. It's very hot outside, so, so I'm sweating. Just did the laundry and picked this up. Period, and got water jugs. Wait, I opened it the wrong way. So I have to go open it that way so we can slide it up. How are we gonna do that? We just have to slide it up from this way. It's five o'clock and it's time to get ready for youth group. My playing guitar practicing for worship and I need to find something to wear. I don't know if I'm gonna keep these sweatpants on or I don't know what we're gonna do with these. <laughs> This is the laundry that I have to fold on Matthew did today. Um, so let's figure out something to wear. This is my outfit. Ripped jeans, oversized long sleeve. We're keeping the braids. The braids are gonna stay because I don't feel like redoing them. And I just finished my makeup. You have to show them your outfit. Nothing crazy, it's just simple. I just got a plain tee shirt on with, and it's red and it's white and it says dreamer because I be dreaming big, you know what I'm saying? All right. <laughs> yeah, I be dreaming big. Tell us some of my dreams. Matthew's dreams? To meet Stephen Curry? That's definitely a big dream. I'm talking about my own personal dreams. <laughs> oh, the dreams that you have at night? Where you're screaming and you wake up and you're talking about how you're first into to get vanilla ice cream? It's right. Like barely recording yourself. It's time you guys meet another member of our family. We've been kind of keeping him a secret, not because we don't want you guys to know him, but we were just trying to respect his privacy. Welcome. I can't believe we get to finally say this to them. This is crazy. Meet Scrappy. Look at our cute little fish. His name is Scrappy Doo, because his brother's name is Scooby Doo, and he lives in a pineapple under his his little, uh, his mini C. A little bit shy, and I'm his favorite because Matthew doesn't take care of him. Bro, that is such a lie. I just, you just want the responsibility. So no, I it's not that I want the responsibility. If I left here for a week, would you remember to feed the fish at least once? Yes, more than once. Probably right. three times. Three times, right. Out of the whole week you remember three times, that says a lot about what kind of parent you are to our fish. He only needs to be fed like- No, you, we we are spoiling our fish. He needs to be eating every single day, you hater. So wouldn't that be the opposite of spoiling our fish? We're no. not spoiling him? That's why there's a fly flying around you. Can you smell? Wait, where? It's gone. I don't smell, I just shower. It's the next day. What else will we do except for forget that we're vlogging? and forget to pick up the camera again. Anyways, I'm on a solo trip this evening. Matthew is not feeling good um, for some time now. Um, and so he originally was gonna come out with me tonight and run the errands, but I'm just running errands by myself. So right now we're at Walmart. I have to get a couple things and you guys are gonna come. Okay, I am not. Somebody literally just walked past me and gave me the evil eye for absolutely no reason. Anyways, I'm not good at filming the public, so. I'm gonna go in this corner just to tell you guys what I got so far. I found these really cute fall flowers. I think that's very fall vibes. And it's only $4.95, so that's a steal. I came here for a bunch of other things, but I can't um, I can't talk to the camera while I do that. Uh, too much secondhand embarrassment of myself. Here you go. Flowers. I already told him that I got it. <laughs> Excuse my dirtiness. I am sick. As previously stated before. Important. Ooh, is that good? Hmm. Some shrimp curry I made. Okay, I have to tell you something important. Don't double dip. Did you notice I, I just... did the dishes? They were dirty? Yeah. Oh, thank you. Why don't you play tonight? I don't know. If you put a box in my cup, I 
will shut the heck up. What the heck, bro? <laughs> We're making a flu bomb at You guys have seen it in our TikTok. If you pull it up, we'll go. All right, trying to remember what we need. Feist. We need a feist. Lemon. Lemon squeeze. We got our water the other day. Um, and it tastes like absolute rubber. So we've just been using water bottles until we can replace our water. He's referring to this gal right here. Oh. You can see me, that's awkward. <laughs> <laughs> I'm feeling very uncomfortable. Listen, I, I understand you think I'm a star, but I'm not all that. I'm just mad. <laughs> I know you're trying to rhyme. You know, anytime. <laughs> Shut up. Anytime you need a rhyme. The fact that I did not spill a single thing. I literally can work at a restaurant and pay them bills. Um, Carly, get the heck out of my face right now. Um, I need ginger and garlic. Where's the heck is the garlic? Oh. Are you serious? Dang. This thing is growing a whole new garlic plant. Get the heck out of my face, bro. <laughs> what the heck, bro? I hope you guys know it's all jokes. Peace, love, and positivity. <laughs> Are you logic? No, but I have logic. <laughs> I'm like, oh, nothing like my honey, my chill baby. Wow. Talk about this honey. First, you start off with some honey. I can really, like, you know how sometimes people describe food and it kind of soothes you? I can be one of those people. Just let me, give me a second. So first you put the honey because it really soothes your throat. You know, you have to um, make sure you have something that soothes you. Okay. Um, up next, I'm going to roll our lemons out. Take out a random knife. That is, Doesn't Matthew, matter. that is a bu don't use that. That is a for a bread knife. I know, but it's fine. No, it's not. What is your problem? Oh, you have to choose the biggest knife possible to cut up. <laughs> that you are already cut into. Just use a small knife, please. You're ruining my cooking channel. Back to what we were learning is that you cut a lemon and then you cut another lemon and then you gotta squeeze. Careful the seeds. It's fine if the seeds go in. You gotta squeeze your with your muscles. I mean, what, what else do you go to the gym for? Like, please, going to the gym really means you need to be able to squeeze a lemon. <laughs> Why else are you going? Damn to look man. good for that girl that ain't paying attention to you? Oh, burn. Roasted. You, you need to go to the gym to know how to squeeze a lemon. Like that? Like that. Oh, actually, now that I think about it, um, I think we gotta take those seeds out. <laughs> it's getting a bit crazy in there. Up next, cyan pepper. <laughs> so, the lady explaining it says, put it if you dare. So, me and Carly do dare. We're not white. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You can leave that out. <laughs> Guys, you need ginga. And honestly, usually you should do this with a spoon because, um, can easily cut yourself the way I'm doing it. But, all right, slide your ginga in. All right. What about this? What? To mess. Um. So the mess. Um. Yeah, that can be cleaned later. Right now, we got hot water going in to our food bomb. You don't put any tea tree oil. Oh my goodness! This is why you get married. <laughs> because where you shall lack, she shall help. That is not in the Bible, but <laughs> I just made that verse up. Putting some more honey for my honey. Yo, why you all up in my grill, bro? <laughs> up next, we got tea tree oil. When I say one drop, I mean it. That's it. Do not go further. I know you want to, but don't. Have self-control. All right, watch again. Second cup. This is not the same cup. This is a completely different cup. Relax. Second cup. Oh, that's close to do. <laughs> then you gotta mix it around town. Mix it around the town. Now let me be frank, this tastes like absolute dog cucka. <laughs> that's everything. Get out of my face. <laughs> Cheers me, you crazy man. Oh, all these seeds I'm about to drink. Still hot. Oh. Oh.
Aim like this. Oh. Matthew. That's it, I'm tapping out.